in last video we start with ola map api and we have connected using the python so you have you have not watched the previous video go and watch that video how we calculated the distance between source and destination so you can learn that and how to create the credential i have also shown that in the video if you want a specific video for how to get the api key and the credential credential uh, so ping me in the comment i'll i'll, I'll make sure i'll create a one video for you, for you guys so if if you are new here make sure you subscribe to the channel and share with your friend hit the like button and give us the a shout out uh, on linkedin Uh, because I'm going to share my LinkedIn page in the description, so you uh, can share with your uh, your uh, friends in on LinkedIn and also uh, repost our uh, video. And I'm going to share the source code uh, of this uh, API, how I created HTML code, Python code, and all those things I have created uh, by using the GitHub. I'm going to share my GitHub GitHub link in the description in in the in the in the. uh in this video uh but before that i'm going to cover one more thing that a lot of people have commented so someone want like dhananjay singh want uh, more video on ola map i know that that's why i'm creating the one video that will uh, calculate the distance also and it will show the map for the source and the destination so it will be it will going to be a, a one of the best video uh then someone want uh, source code this panda someone want that somya So yeah, some panda want a uh, uh, source code, and and definitely I'm gonna share that. Uh, then uh, he want create some more project on Ola. That's why I'm creating the source the source the source code. I'm gonna share the descrip description of it link in the in this video. And someone who uh, have the question, what is the request ID? Uh, what we should post on uh, request ID? It is a client ID or a sec uh, client secret. It's a client ID. I already mentioned in the comment, but still I'm. Uh, Gonna cover this. Actually, my credential is not working right now. The thing is, I forgot the password. I'm able to do a little bit. So I forgot the password, and I'm not able to relog in it. Uh, I I try to do the forgot and all those things, but it's not working right now. Maybe whenever it is possible, I'll I'll create one video, video on. Uh, how can I? Ah, okay. I'm just sliding over here. Okay. So. uh in upcoming video I, i'm going to show uh, one demo on how to create a api key and this um, uh, the the credential which needed to our project so okay uh so first of all you need to go and google it out like ola map and when uh, just click on this maps dot ola kritrim dot com once you click in you'll you'll get up this page this this um it's uh, it's a time to exit uh, google map this is the slogan of ola uh, maps and uh, redefining location intelligence so we believe in providing the power of location intelligence to everyone build in india for a world so you need to click on get started for free here uh, this is the authentication in the authentication you can see uh, uh, they have shown how to create uh, your project over here and how to link uh, link this subscription so when you create a new project you need to click on uh, link subscription so, uh, once you clicked on it uh, you need to fill some uh, project name uh, all description once you create you need to click on this uh, box and link the subscription once you link the subscription uh, you need to click on this uh, this button you'll get all the credential you have like like this so yeah use this api key and this client key for your project okay uh, so uh, there are some theoretical thing i need to uh, cover before i'm going to show the code uh, because in the code I, i have not done very much because i just display the uh, display the map uh, the map of world and the source location and destination it will show the specific specific source and the destination and it it will uh, uh, give give us a straight line between source and destination so this that's what i have covered but um, before moving into the uh, coding part i'll i'll share one thing this is the have a have a sun formula to find the distance between two points this is the uh, density formula density inverse formula for uh, calculating the distance between two gps point with using the python they have given the code over here not code they have given the uh, formula over here you need to calculate that and you, you need to put that but i'm not going to uh, cover all those things but these are the three formula not only three there are multiple uh, there are different formulas which calculate the distance between two uh, two source location here we are not providing i don't know what we are providing here but uh, here we are providing the uh, longitude and latitude here uh so that it will uh, calculate the distance and this is the for formula you can refer this geeks for geeks website 
and this is how you can calculate using the python and this is the great uh, great circle distance which is which uh, formula i have used in my code to calculate the distance between two to uh, source and um, uh, destination we need to provide the longitude and latitude it is a simple formula you have given and you have to put the uh, put the uh, values over there of uh, longitude and latitude of source and destination and it will uh, calculate the distance between two uh, two points okay now uh, you can go and watch i'm going to share the link also in the description so that you can read that and uh, if you want you can do the more research on that so uh, uh let's cover the coding part uh this is the key key dot py where i kept my key api key and request key i'm not going to show to you guys because it's a private key you need you don't need to show anyone okay uh it is secret key you can say this is the html code i have uh, i have created uh, uh this is the a uh, app dot py in app dot py we have the uh, flask then we have uh, used the request uh, for rendering the api or getting the api information then we have a keys this is the my internal library i have created and this is the geopy it is one of the library to calculate the distance between uh two destination from that we have taken the grid circle uh, imported the grid circle we have created the app we have given the api key and request key you have uh, if you are not watched my previous video go and watch previous video i have explained all this code in in the previous video i'm just doing the same thing here uh, if you if you want to go and watch that get the coordinate i'm getting the coordinate i'm pu pu pushing the uh, address here uh, the address will be source and destination. Uh, this uh, function is used here in the index uh, to calculate the uh, uh, lang uh, uh, latitude and longitude for source and the destination. Here I'm passing the my source as address and the API key. And again, the destination at the, at the address, it will cal calculate the um, longitude and latitude for source and destination. So I have done one thing here. Uh, in uh, in uh, index space it is a read write because i have taken the uh, because i'm going to display the uh, display the map also that's why we are using the uh, get and post as a method then we have uh, taken the variable distance source coordinated and uh, destination co uh, coordinates because we need to pass those into the html page we need that thing uh, variable into the our html page i'm going to use the uh, jinga over there uh, to do some work over there so after that we have taken the post and post is nothing but the writing something so uh, I have uh, taken the source and destination as store as a source address and the destination address. After taking that, I use my uh, function called get destination and I'm passing my source address and the destination address. So I'm getting the variable called source source longitude and source longitude and latitude and destination uh, latitude and longitude. After getting that, uh, I'm writing the single function like uh, not a function. Uh, this is a if, if statement. If I don't have null value, if I don't have a null value, then and then only it will proceed. So I'm not have a null value so what it uh, what it takes it create the source code by using the uh, latitude and longitude it create the source coordination and destination coordination once i got the source code and destination code i'm passing it to the grid circle uh, and dot kilometer so it calculate the distance between those uh, coordinates and giving it to uh, kilometer and i'm also passing the distance i'm also passing the source code as a source code and destination to the html page html page so in html html page we have written some code over here I'm going to show that, uh, share that in the, in the uh, git, git. Uh, so I'm using the, uh, some JavaScript over here to pass into the, uh, this is the default center of India, which is, I have passed here. And this is the, uh, uh script I'm using that, uh, this is, I have taken from some reference page and then I put it here and again, I'm passing the source destination and, uh, uh source cards and destination cards to calculate that. And once get that, I'm taking the source maker a marker and destination marker so that it will point out the two location and i'm passing to lat long bond so that it will uh, uh, give me the exact uh, line over there okay and the co color of that line will be uh, polyline called blue so uh, to add to the map so this is a simple source code i'll, I'll gonna i'm not gonna explain that because i really don't understand but i uh, anyhow i do the jugad and i got to know that this is how i need to pass there so Okay, so I'm not gonna wait you more. I'll just write Python app dot py, and uh, if you can see here, okay, it is taking a, a lot more time. Let's wait. Okay, I'll just click on here. This is the local link. So wait for it open. Okay, uh, this is my channel name, engineer YouTuber, and you can see this is the uh, default coordinate, coordinate or default map of uh, India. It shows because we have given the uh, code over there. Now I'm gonna write the Pune because I'm staying in Pune, and the uh, destination is Mumbai location. And I want to uh, get the route, so I'll just put it get the route. So you can see this is the blue line. 
from Pune to Mumbai and it calculated the distance 122.44 because it is taking the uh, I'm calculating using the great circle distance what it does it uh, it take the destination and source and uh, uh, take a straight line and calculate the distance from that so uh, this is the shortest distance this is how it calculated so for example if I give Mumbai and here I like Kolkata what it will does let's try to calculate that okay so it is calculating that you can see here uh, 1600, 16, uh, 1651 is the calculated distance and this is the uh, a line blue line you can see this is how it looks so yeah this is a small uh, small uh, app you can create by using that or you can use in your uh, if you have seen um, uh, apps like a Zomato, Swiggy or a, a Uber or Ola and actually it is created by Ola so they previously used the Google map and this is how they calculate and this, this is the small API or this is the small uh, app they are built in their um, software to show the client how, how much distance and all those things we can create by using the simple simple thing but this is the small project I have created using the Ola map and thank you for watching this video make sure, make sure you hit the subscribe button because last video ne, logo ne dekha, around 4 five hundred logo ne dekha. but from that only five uh, five people subscribe to my channel and this is not fair guys i'm getting uh ye jo create karne ko, thoda sa time lagta hai, mehnat lagti hai, and and that's why i'm saying thank you for watching this video even you can share on your linkedin page uh and i'm going to share my uh, personal uh, linkedin id in the description so that you can follow me and also reshare my post or you can just upload that in your linkedin page and share the uh, uh subscribe to the channel and like as much as and share with your friend thank you for watching this video and stay tuned uh if you have any question uh comment down below i'll make sure i'll resolve all those questions thank you so can i close this? Pause me. Stop.